Before watching the video, please read the disclaimer here, and be sure to check the description for how you can support the original release. And with that said, enjoy the video. Hello everyone, this is Controlled Chaos speaking, and I'm here reacting to the latest TF2 analysis from the channel Dr. Wolf, A Tight Budget, Part 1. You heard right, this is apparently going to be another multi-parter. Will we have two or three parts? I don't know. But what I do know is that it features a certain alternate... Hold on, how do I phrase this? Oh yeah. A certain alter ego... Should I call him an alter ego? Whatever, different character, made by Finn the Pony, Ella Tightwad who is a more, uh, why do I keep forgetting words? He's more straight-laced and no-nonsense and all about the wads as to compared to Finn. Anyways, I'm interested to see how this is going to play out. It could be really good or it could end up really bad for the group. Let's find out. But either way, is to it's going to be an entertaining time, Patreon I'm sure. Find out how you can support TF2 Analysis Anarchy by clicking the links below. Yes, do check out their Patreon and coffee. Ah. Money, money, money. Uh-oh. Listen. I appreciate the uh. concern, but I don't think I need another visit quite so soon. Still suffering from the chocolate no, incident, no, huh? It's been almost a week since she... Er, I ate all that chocolate. I'm sure I'll be fine. Thank you. Nice to put a time frame on it. Oh my. I assure you, I am perfectly healthy enough to work. Hmm. The team depends on me, and I can't possibly... Ah! And now I see where Tightwad comes in. Any more than it already has. Have a good day. Hmm. I don't know. Alright, what's next? And over there is Goldie's favorite sniping spot, and over there is Voices' favorite cool. sniping spot, and that's where I usually eat my lunch on Tuesdays, and that's where I usually eat my lunch on Wednesdays. What's that on this wrist? Is that a smart, is that a smart watch? Ooh, thanks for the tip. Huh? <laughs> no. None of that. I missed that. Shame on you. Uh, quick skip back. There is Voice's favorite sniping spot, and that's where I usually eat my lunch on Tuesdays, and that's where I usually eat my lunch on Wednesdays, and that's where Doc hides all the spare sweets so Blissy can't get to them. Oh, uh, okay. Thanks for the tip. <laughs> no. No. None of that. None of that. <laughs> Shame on you. Hopefully that gets rid of that pesky memory. And that's where Blissy was three seconds ago. Right. Any questions so far? Uh, just one. What's your salary like at this place? I mean, when you combine costs for combat services and risking your life, as well as any comedic hijinks and or shenanigans that come up, you should be making 300 an hour with this gig. Oh no, we don't get paid here. This is just a team building exercise made by Doc. And what we don't make in money, we earn in friendship. And... <sighs> Finn, you gotta start thinking about what your time is worth here. You know you can't mm. buy food or pay rent with friendship. Hey, Meh. I still work in the pie shop. You're applying for a position at the bank. We're perfectly fine with money. But good buddies are one in a million. I see. If new memories means getting shot in the head for free, then I'm all for it. After all, I don't care too much for money. Mm-hmm. Money can't buy me love. <laughs> Aw, he does care. <laughs> Weirdo. Hmm. Ah, glad to see you finally made it, Finn. And, uh, might I ask who this is? Oh, right. Hmm? Doc, this is my best buddy and roommate, Tightwad. Sup? Hmm. I brought him here because, well, we've got a bit of a situation we need to run by you. Oh? And that 
would be? Uh, well, I mean, you see, uh, what he is trying to say is that I got busted for running an underground banana smuggling ring, but my charges were lessened when I argued that I was making people healthier by putting more potassium in their diets, and they agreed that I was doing more good than harm. So instead of going straight to prison, they put me under what they call friend's arrest. I can't be more than two miles away from Blue Boy over here or the boys in Blue Boy. Oh, I see. You are too far away from your designated friendo. Prepare to be mercilessly tased. I see. Oh, never mind. Have a pastry. <gasps> Yay. That's so been thought to process. Give me a tour and show me how this whole Team Fortress thing works. Well, I suppose there's no harm in having you here. No. Unfortunately, I can't just let you two roam freely. This is a war zone, you know. Mm -hmm. Only skilled mercenaries are allowed. Right. I, what? But we haven't even gotten to the best parts yet. Finn was going to mm -hmm. show me the economy. Last I checked, you can get two grand for a rocket launcher. All you got to do is paint it gold and add a bunch of adjectives like vintage or kill streak. Yep. <laughs> I'm sorry, Mr. Tightwad, but for your own sake, but yeah, I suggest the economy you is the pretty botched right now when it comes to TF2. Don't worry, Tightwad. I think I've got an idea. Oh? So you control the drone from this tablet here, and you can see everything going on through the tiny camera on the front. Cool. I call it Spectator. Try ah. Let's have a look. Hmm. Alrighty. Hopefully you don't get shot down in an accident. Looking at Jasper. So what do you see? Ooh. Uh uh. -oh. I see a red dot shooting a blue dot. And the signal's red going dot bad. Just exploded out of nowhere. Oh, and now there's a massive red dot pointing right at the I had a feeling. I was kind of expecting Jesper, but seems one of the snipers caught wind. Uh, that wasn't anything important, was it? Hey, I'm not risking another robot takeover. Today it's the drones. Tomorrow could be the vending machines. Fair enough. Uh, I'm pretty sure those things were always evil. Huh. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't want any of this heartbreak. All I wanted was a soda. Hmm. <laughs> Soon we shall be reunited, my dear Mellow Yellow. <laughs> right. Well, so much for that. Well, that's just great. <sighs> Look, I'm sorry, man. I thought if I was chaperoning you, Doc would be fine with everything. Hey, if you want, we could play certified public accountant. Which edition? Eh? Um... Third? Nah, that's the worst one. Too much number crunching. Is that a dig on D&D? Oh. &D? Alright. Uh, I've got your favorite Countess Call Retour mixtape. Ah, don't bother. I burned a CD with better audio quality. Oof. W well, uh, m maybe we could... Uh, we could... Uh, look, Finn, it's just not worth it. Can we just clock out early and go home? Yeah, sure thing, buddy. Oh well, it was worth a shot. Hmm, I'm sure he'll have a look at this and hey, Doc. one look, and he's gonna have really an idea. Doing it for us. You mind if we just leave early for the day? I suppose so. It is a bit of a slow training day, and I've still got finances to deal with. Mm -mm. <coughs> you heard finances. So there won't be any engineers needed on the field today. Finances, huh? Now that's more like it. What kind of numbers are you working with here? Oh, nothing too extreme. Usual figures and usual returns. It's just a matter of sorting through it all. Hmm, all right. Makes sense to me. What does he see? <laughs> um... You okay there, bud? It just don't add up. Oh boy. Um, is this normal? 
Oh, yeah, I've seen this before. He's just having a seizure. <laughs> seizure? Oh, goodness, I should call the medics then. No. No, 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 no. Seizure with a dollar sign. He sees a massive price for something and his brain starts questioning reality. But don't worry, he should be done right of that. What in the name of four easy payments of $9.99 are you doing? Huh? Now. You cannot be serious with these expenses. This, this has got to be some kind of joke, right? That is not a small number. Yeah. That is a big number. Yeah. Pardon me, Mr. Tightwad, but we run a very tight operation here. No pun intended. Tight? Tight? You would go tight if it reached out and... <sighs> Alright. Apologies. That was uncalled for. But honestly, Doctor, there needs to be some serious changes around here. And not mm -hmm. just tiny little fixes either. You gotta revamp the entire financial infrastructure. If you want, I could take the wheel for a while and clean up some of this mess. Hmm. Mm, I would suggest under supervision. I suppose I'd appreciate the help. But even if I wanted to put you in charge, it's not just up to me. This team decides on everything as a group, and you'll need the majority rule before I'm able to. And done. A Wait, what? Document with signatures from most members of both teams. How'd you manage that? What? How? What? I mean. That's so fast. Let's just say I can be very persuasive. Let's see. Help us make cute a curse word so the censors will bleep it out. Done. Help convince Skunk Gate to make a fourth season of Sam and Max. Done. Help change the national anthem to "We Are Number One" on Stefan Carl Stevenson's birthday. Done. You. Help us at least seven hundred feet from every uvidaphone. Done. Help me if you can. I'm feeling down. Done. I noticed the whiteout on that. Huh. Well, all right then. It seems like everything is in order. Though I believe you're one signature short. Not a problem at all. Go ahead, Finn. <laughs> Sign it. Uh, mm. Yeah, you know him. You okay, buddy? I don't know about this, Tightwad. I know how you get when you're given power over money. <sighs> Finn, you can trust me on this. Those are all massive government corporations. This is just a dried out shooting range. What? I won't go too nuts, I promise. But please, Finn, this could be my only chance to have some real fun with this place. I just need a little bit of help from my best buddy. I don't trust I... this. I don't trust this either. All right. All right, no take backs. Are you sure about this, Finn? You don't seem very certain. No, 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 I am. I am. I'm, I'm going to trust him. And besides, I'll be keeping an eye on him the whole time anyway. Yeah. He can't legally go far without me, after all. True. All right, and that is a legal document, people. Time to whip this place into shape. All so, right. Doctor, you got some kind of PA system I can use? We do, but I don't think our announcer wants anyone else touching it. Leave that to me. How do you handle Mary Sue? Check, check. Is this thing on? Hi, everypony! Just a friendly reminder that I am still Mary Sue! I'd like, like to thank every pony who signed my Turn the Red Team pink petition, including No Way, Definitely Not, and Never in a Million Years! Mary Sue loves you, even if you do have weird names. Bye! Uh oh. Now what? <laughs> Are you seriously trying it, buddy? Let's see how this works. I still want to see him do it. Yep, so, she seems a little... This is the angelic voice that I've been hearing over the loudspeaker. Mm. The way you speak paints a very flattering picture, I must admit. But looking with my own eyes, it isn't nearly as lovely as... She... Is trying to back away. As much as I hate to pull you away from your job, which you do quite well, I do need to use the microphone for just a tiny second. You don't mind, do you, Cupcake? Your very existence makes me sick. Me, it. Best announcement booth ever. Oh <laughs> uh, yeah, uh, I'll take it from here. Sorry, Mary. Taiwan can be a little much. He just needs to make one announcement, and he'll be out of your main for good. I promise. Plus, Doc said it was okay. Hmm. Fine. But time to speak. 
stuck with the sucking up. I'm already spoken for. Oh. And no one oh. Will ever come <laughs> Of course. Who else but Mary Sue? To the black. Of course. Reference. Huh. Not gonna lie, Mary's impression of a nasally snob is pretty spot on. Of course. Well, that ought to do it. Thanks for the mic, cotton candy. And personally, I'd say lose the pink. It's not really your color. Oh no. So, wonder how many bones he's about to get broken. Place your bets. How many bones? Hmm. I count at least four. Thank you for catching up. And now we have an angry Mary Sue. Uh, you got something? Huh. Thank goodness for you, Finn. Thank goodness for you. Barbie definitely helps. But I'm still gonna kill him later. Sure. Yeah. Oh. Hey, hey, life in the dream house. Oh yeah, life in the dream house. Later on. Hmm. Hmm. So, when's trouble gonna rear its ugly head? And Dooney quietly stalks her rainbow prey, watching every subtle movement, waiting for the perfect moment to proudly pounce. The firebrand rolls his eyes, questioning his choice of pocket. Hey, we all missed the bird, but changes need to be made if we're gonna survive. Now shush up. Oh yeah, they are down and heavy, aren't they? Is now. Uh oh, here it comes. Look, while I commend you for your dedication and interesting stealth tactics, I'm afraid I can't allow you to use those guns anymore. What? What? You can't just Ammunition. Right away from me? He's practically a member of the team. Sorry, kid, but the numbers don't lie. It costs four hundred thousand dollars to fire that thing for twelve seconds, and we uh. made money around here. So no more stardust or whatever he's called. Hmm. Then you what do just you? Call me a kid. Hey, and that goes for you too, Scotty. Every time you fire a rocket and it misses, it's a hole in the wall and a dent in my wallet. So no boom boom for you. Uh oh. <laughs> so what now? <laughs> hey, 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 no need to get feisty. I've still got weapons for you to use that are much more cost efficient. I wonder what that could be. Oh boy. Are these... Uh, are these Nerf guns. guns. Yep. You can still use them to work on your aim, and when you're out of bullets, just pick them up and use them again. You only gotta pay for one clip of ammo. As for you, Mr. Medical Horse, I'm gonna have to take that medigun too. What the? Hey, how is that fair? I mean, you do realize this thing can heal any injury, right? That's way cheaper than anything you'd find in a normal hospital thanks to the ridiculous charge masters. Oh, you'd think. But the power source for that thing actually siphons out more money than the minigun. It'd be cheaper if you hmm. just learn the real techniques. What are you talking about? I'm talking about online medical school. I know a guy who owes me a favor, and he's already enrolled you. Now go, go, go! Huh. Well, look at the bright side. At least with foam bullets, we won't have to worry about anybody getting hurt. It's just another... <laughs> oh no! Just another... <laughs> Leave it to Jasper. Okay. Yeah, choking hazard. <laughs> oh no! 
I hope the respawn generator is still. Hey, I said debtor is better, not wetter. Cut. What the? Rocks? Huh? Hey, oh, you seriously charcoal briquette. Set my enemies ablaze literally like a Neanderthal? How is that okay? Eh. Oh, um, okay, I guess that kind of works, but still. Yeah. Uh oh. Uh, what the? Hey, what gives? How am I supposed to fool anyone with this thing? Hey, I happen to be high profile in the Colton community, and he's forcing me to work for scale. How do you think I feel? Welcome what the? <laughs> nah. All right, that is it. No more, Mr. Nice Guy. Hmm? This concludes our final lesson. Congratulations, Doctor. Huh. Well, look at that. No more, Doctor Nice Guy. That penny pincher is out of here. Meanwhile. Sweet, sweet zeros. A couple more cuts and I might even make double my daily quota. <laughs> oh, F is for funds, more cash in my pocket. U is for you, all V. Uh oh. Uh, uh. Listen, Tidewad, I'm glad you're finally having fun, but don't you think we should stop now before you start going over the edge again? I mean, again, you, you say. Remember what we talked about, right? Know when you've had enough? Know when to walk away? Don't swim too long in bugs, so you'll end up with paper cuts? Hmm. You know what, Finn? You're right. I'm Shoo. serious, Taiwan. If you don't ease up, you're gonna... Wait. I... Shoo. I am? Okay. I mean, even if I stop now, I'm still walking away with a pretty penny. Not to mention a shiny new nameplate. So, yeah, I think I'm good. <laughs> oh, buddy, I'm so proud of you. Wait, what? Uh, What's that uh, noise? Who? Oh, not so fast, Captain Greenback. Me and my new lawyer that I consciously decided to bring back to this bit took a look at your little legal document and we discovered it's anything but. Sue! You acquired all these signatures under false pretenses, meaning yep. that your position of power isn't legally binding at all. Sue! <laughs> Uh, I... But False right. pretense. Apply some intravenous fluids and do some cosmetic reconstruction because you just got burned! Sue, 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 sue! Huh. Apply some and do... Huh? You made me sit through 14 hours of medical turns. I'm not gonna use them! <laughs> I expect your stuff and your gluteus maximus to vacate the premises in 10 minutes, or I get to kick it out myself. See Right. Yes? Hello? Who keeps calling my name? Not you. Get out of here. <laughs> Anyways, any last requests, jerkwad? <laughs> Uh-oh. Hmm. Oh, uh, no. Actually, yes. I do have a last request. Cutting lawyers from the budget. Sue what now? <sighs> oh my. Such power. Such gore. I was not expecting that. Oh no. He's got... He's got... The same thing I did with everything that wasn't working. I got rid of it. This is bad. Maybe there are some... Other things around here that aren't quite working. Here we go. Maybe a few tiny cuts isn't enough. Maybe I need to dig deeper. Dun 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 to be continued. Well. <laughs> but yeah, I was wondering how they were going to stretch it out. And now I see. Well, this is a fine kettle of fish. 
So let's recap. Uh, we have an uproarist team getting massive cutbacks a la Tightwad. We've discovered that Tightwad has money bending powers and now he's gone over the deep end just as Finn feared. I wonder how this is going to resolve or how it's going to escalate whichever one comes first. Well, in any case, if you enjoyed this reaction, be sure to hit the subscribe button and make sure the bell's ringing. That will keep you up to date. Ooh, me. That will keep you up to date on my uploads. Also, be sure to check out my Twitter page. I'll be putting polls and events there. And with all that said, thank you for watching. This is Controlled Chaos. Signing out.